The African wild dog, also known as the Cape Hound or Painted Dog, often roams the open plains and sparse forests of sub-Saharan Africa. This long-legged canine has only four toes on each paw instead of the five common canines. Their name means painted wolf in Latin, referring to their irregular mottled coat and patches of distinctive colors such as red, black, brown, white and yellow. Each has its own unique coat color and they all have large round ears. Herd behavior and how to hunt. African wild dogs live in packs and are often ruled by a pair of pack leaders responsible for reproduction. Females usually give birth to 2 to 20 cubs in each spawning, which are then cared for by the entire flock. This wild dog is extremely social. They are known for being able to share food and support members when weak or sick. Social interaction is quite common in this dog. They often communicate with each other by tail wagging gestures. The African wild dog hunts in packs of 6 to 20 or more. Dogs often gather in large herds before the species becomes endangered. These packs often hunt antelope and will also gladly grab larger prey, such as wildebeest, especially when their prey is sick or injured. These dogs also supplement their diet with several species of rodents. In the world of wildlife, each species has its own strengths. Whenever there is danger to be near or to approach their prey, they will use this strength to escape or vice versa. If talking about the most ferocious predator, perhaps we cannot ignore the African wild dog. This is a dog that hunts in packs, in fights with prey, they are often very aggressive. Even with animals bigger than me, thanks to the strength of their teammates, they can take down an antelope with ease. Characteristics of the African Wild Dog The African Wild Dog belongs to the family of dogs distributed in Africa. The breed was described by Temink in 1820. The African Wild Dog is known to be the master of the art of coordinated savanna hunting. They also have one of the strongest bites of any carnivorous mammal. This species specializes in hunting antelope. They catch by chasing to make their prey tired and exhausted. Like other dogs, this breed burps out food for its young. But this action is also extended to older children. This is known as the foundation of feral dog social life. They have very few natural predators. But lions are a major source of these dog deaths. There are also spotted hyenas, which are frequent predators. Sometimes the poor impala is standing in the middle of a shadow. It was surrounded by aggressive predators standing on the shore listening. After a moment of hesitation, realizing that the water was not deep, a wild dog in the pack decided to take the initiative to attack. It waded forward, using its strong jaws to squeeze its prey's mouth to pull it ashore. Poor Sometimes the poor antelope prey is standing in the middle of a shallow lake. It was surrounded by aggressive predators standing on the shore. After a moment of hesitation, realizing that the water was not deep, a wild dog in the pack decided to take the initiative to attack. It waded forward, using its strong jaws to squeeze its prey's mouth to pull it ashore. Poor gazelle entrenched in weakness. It had to give up when another wild dog came to support its comrade. Hold ashore, the antelope, of course, is no match for the aggressive pack of wild dogs. It eventually becomes a delicious meal for predators. <laughs>